the Daily Graphic this morning. It says, ECOWAS condemns actions leading to Mali instability. And court orders Achimota School to admit Rastafarians. Encroachment derails real development. Accra Kumasi lands taking over. What's on the back page? Shisha electronic cigarettes not safe. That's the FDA warning everybody yesterday as we marked the World Tobacco Day. Man buries disabled child alive. Accomplice prophetess on the run. Uh, this is pure madness, if you ask me. Ghanaian Times. Veep donates 300,000 Ghana cities to Kokoko Charities Foundation. And after massive decongestion of Accra, traders are back on streets. Um, maybe they had nowhere to go, or maybe they are just recalcitrant. We'll get into the detail. NIA begins nationwide issuance of Ghana cards on June 7. The ABC News. National security breaks Chinese crime ring in Asankregua. And Vice President Bomia donates five incubators to Kokoko Charities Foundation. Also, re Professor Nana Jeno Pukwajiman is a uh, stake on excellent WASI result. And editorial, war on Galamse can't be a walk in the park, which is why we don't need to walk and tour or talk and tour. We need to actually act. BNFT, government industrialization agenda still on course, trade minister. And also Galamse, effects on environment and government uh, fight against it. That's uh, Paul Grave, Bachi Dankwa, my good friend there, formerly of the Dankwa Institute. BOG swerves market with 100 basis cuts in policy rate. And airplanes anticipate easing of COVID-19 protocols for vaccinated passengers. Tax payment goes online today. The Daily Guide. Court sets June 22 for Jomoro MP documents. Brim versus Indum. U.S. fraud fight deepens. Achimota SHS ordered to admit Rasta students and local OMCs form breakaway group. Man grabbed for bearing son alive. What's the back page? Suleiman Tari loses his mother. Condolences to the brother and may her soul rest in peace. Zidane explains real exit. Ran M Glover holds football clinic and Aguero completes Barca move. And whenever I talk about football, I'm reminded of Astro Chess and I talk about Robert Coleman as well. Good morning to you, Blair. Be Robert Coleman as well. Uh, Dennis Abwaji is joining as the former municipal chief executive of the Equipim North uh, Municipal Assembly. And also with us is the Honorable Roxin Nelson Eche Dafia Mapo. He is a member of parliament for the North Dying, uh, South Dying, I beg your pardon, South Dying Constitution. I used to say die. He taught me that there's an end there that somebody has kept away from our eyes. So, South Dying. Council, welcome. Good morning. How are you doing? Well, tired, but okay. You're tired. Yes. Yes. Parliamentary work. Yes. Come back to it. Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, you'll be fine. Lots of work. Tomorrow, the vetting is starting. Yes. Are you on the vetting committee? No, I'm not. You are not. I'm but not. you said you would be on the vetting committee. Well, I, I think that story got a bit twisted. Okay. It was at the tail end of the, of the interview. Interview, yeah. And the question was, um, if I'm requested to right. serve, would I? Right. And so why not? Because okay. uh, when you're asked to serve on a committee, you serve. And mm. then, boom. <laughs> but were you, were you asked? Well. Were you asked to serve? Indeed, yes. You were asked. But, but the, the option was to relinquish my place on the public accounts committee. Oh, okay. And I didn't want to do oh, okay. that. So. Okay, okay. Ah, so you had to lose one in order yes, to be yes, on the yes, other one. Yes. You chose the public accounts yes, committee. Yes. I, I prefer the public accounts to the appointments committee. I see. Yes. Any reason? Well, uh, public accounts will give me the opportunity to scrutinize uh, government accounts. Okay. Yeah, so I prefer that work to uh, the work on the appointments committee. I see. Yeah, it's... it's, it's it's a matter of okay, matter of choice yes. and, and expertise as well. Yeah. Dennis, how are you doing? Tony, we're good. Grace, 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 Grace. Grace, Grace, Grace. grace. You found a new girlfriend called Grace? Um, no. <laughs> grace of God. Divine grace. Grace of God. Grace of God. Grace of God. Not it keeps... grace I joy anywhere. <laughs> the grace of God. For the records. For the, the records, grace the grace of God. You can join our WhatsApp uh, chat room and it's active for your participation. And uh, please send us thoughts and messages as well. We share it with the rest of the wonderful world. We tweet at TV3GH. And please share your thoughts there as well. We will uh, trans transmit them to the rest of the world who are watching us via DSTV and TV3 online and everywhere else. So they get to know that you're part of active society as well. 
Uh, Dennis, here's a little present for you from last Monday. Take a look. Good morning. They come up with a WhatsApp. You know, they are still sending him the WhatsApp, mm. the propaganda. Mm. A WhatsApp propaganda <laughs> okay. that says that the man that is still under investigation mm. with the CDS, mm. the thing is not conclusive. All of us are aware of it. Which CDS, which president, which mm. CDS, which minister in his right senses would even take such a such okay. a useless action? I, I, and you I, want I us to be discussing it? I come to you. You so, want us to spend our time so discussing my, it? My producer, just pulled, my producer just pulled this up for us. No, no, Hold on. My producer just pulled a portal for us. This is WhatsApp news. Yes. Uh, it's a portal, I'm, I understand, it's been running. Oh, hold on, hold on, please. Hold on, please. So, so this is WhatsApp news. That's their, uh, this free pro, by the way, for them. So this is WhatsApp news. That's how their uh, portal looks like. I understand they also have a printed copy that goes around. And they're talking about Galamse here. All of those things are in there. So... It, it, it lends them. They even have some adverts at the top. Yeah. So, 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 Johnny, recently so the national security arrested, arrested, hold on, recently, the national security arrested the leader of the WhatsApp News. You, He's you. saying that WhatsApp News, he doesn't even you. know. If the national okay. security so, okay, thank arrest, you. No, no, Cookie, no, you can't do this. Cookie, no, you have, you have two points to wrap up. So, I'm saying that, yes. You see this WhatsApp news that all, all your viewers are viewing. Mm. Yes. This WhatsApp news wakes yes. up one Monday morning, yes. sends a one page, it's a one page, mm. a mm. one page mm. news to Honorable Mutala. Honorable Mutala Mohammed on TV3. That the President of the Republic mm. of Ghana, all, the, the, minister, the Minister of National Security, okay. the Chief of Defense Staff, okay. in their right senses, and all of us Ghanaians are so, so, so stupid that somebody who is still under investigation. Mm. And hasn't even probably finished parking from the national security court. It was just barely a week ago. Mm. Back to his post has been which Ghanaian so, living so at so And you said that ah. you have not heard of what's happening. Ah, no, you are just showing so me. So this is the first time you have seen it. Thank you for showing me. Okay. And it doesn't even look right. credible. Uh, no, 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 no. The, 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 we can't keep the lady waiting. That was us on the 24th of uh, May when Honorable Dennis Abaji was here with Honorable Mutala. I'll ask him now, Dennis, have you changed your mind about WhatsApp group, nothing WhatsApp has, news? Nothing has changed. Nothing I mean, has changed. Fundamentally, if you, if you follow the conversations, two things. WhatsApp news, I insist, is a propaganda tool. Okay. Um, this morning, as we are discussing news, with what you have in front of you, you can't even have it there. Mm. It's one of the propaganda tools to sort of spin and twist news. Mm. The second bit is that Kadon Ajumai has not been promoted. Okay. And I insist on that. Promotion is elevation. Kenna Ajumai is with the military. Mm. He was seconded to the national security, was in charge of operations. Mm. He got involved in some actions. The national security minister says, I have reversed your secondment back to your mother institution. Mm. When he goes back to his mother institution, he's not going to sleep. He's okay. going to work. Mm. He's going back to his post. And when he gets back to his post, He's going to be given responsibilities and, and, and duties. Mm. And that's exactly what has been done. What was raised by WhatsApp News was the fact that the president has promoted mm. Colonel Ajiban okay. as we speak. Mm. There is no way that I've heard that Colonel Ajiban has been promoted from his rank to another rank mm. or be promoted from where he used to be to another you know, level within the mm. military. Mm. And so I don't see the head and tail of this. The, the issue that Motala raised on that day was the fact that Colonel Ajiman, or Lieutenant Colonel Ajiman, had been put in charge of the 64 infantry battalion. The, oh, let, me, let me finish my question. And you had shot it down flatly and said that no CDS, no president, no whoever in his right senses would do that. A week on, we have got to know that that appointment really had happened. Let's, Correct. That is not the discussion. The discussion we had was Honorable Mutala saying that mm. Colonel Ajiman had been promoted. That, is, okay. that was a keyword. Okay. He said promoted, and mm. I insist, and I still insist, he has not been promoted. So that was our conversation. So, so you said, Canary. sorry, so you said that you said that nobody in his right would senses, promote him. Oh, yes. Hold on, will promote him. Yes. And. I'm sure that at the tail, it's quite a long, lengthy thing, but this perhaps is just a crux. Mm. Now, the thing is that he was reading from the WhatsApp newspaper to yeah. suggest that the man had been given a no. command position. No. Okay. No. Relax. The conversation Relax. we're having, mm. I think we should stick to the context. Okay. And I insist. I said, 
nobody mm. and his right senses will promote okay somebody who has who is under so, so the man the man is under investigation yes. and he's giving command control yes but he hasn't been promoted okay. that was our conversation okay. so let's take you it, think let's that's right yes okay. of course he's been yeah, reversed yeah, yeah. It, 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 take a minute on it it's, it's yes. not your matter though yes. no but i watched no, because no, our, no. Our, our, our viewers were asking us which I, is why i had to play it for dennis but, to that, also but i want you to put it in i want you to put it on record i want you to put it on record that mm. our conversation was based on the fact that mm. Honorable Mutala referred to a news item of Kenneth Ajibane being promoted. Okay. And as we speak now, there is no way that Kenneth Ajibane has been promoted. You, you said that. For the you, record. you said that. You said that that the NDC thinks that all of us Ghanaians exactly. are fools. Be because that, they wake up in the that morning. barely a week, the man was asked to be withdrawn from the national security. He's been taken to the military he has been, and giving... No. You see, when you're quoting me, you quote me right. Yeah, you have just played it. Mm. I said, the man has been referred mm. and reversed back to his mother institution. Okay. All and right. his secondment has been reversed. Who, in his right senses, when the person is under investigation, would promote him? Okay. And as we speak, nobody has promoted okay. him. Okay. I needed you to put clarity on that. H.A., please take a, a minute on that. Yes, sir. Uh, even though it doesn't really concern you. No, but I, I listened to you. I watched you that mm. day. I was about a week ago. First of all, all print media houses are even going online. So to say that WhatsApp online news uh, bulletin, mm. it's a propaganda tool. It's, it's, it's an unacceptable comment on that print media. Mm. They have decided to, to operate online. TV3, don't you have online portal? You do. So he may not like the kind of news they put out. He could say so. But don't say that it's a propaganda tool. Okay. It's not a propaganda Reserve tool for right. any entity. Right. That's, that's number one. Number two, mm. he's displaying a very limited understanding of the word promotion. When you move an officer on secondment from Ghana Army, mm. who, was, who was holding... A, a certain position within national security apart, apparatus, mm -hmm. which is lower in rank or in prestige to what he occupies now. Is that a, a promotion? I don't get you. Yes. Now, what was his role in, within national security? Director of operations. Yes. And director of operations, for me, in terms of command structure, is lower than to be the commandant of the 64 regiment. And you see, this is what they do. They rather think that we are all fools. We are not. Okay. Uh, it's, it's breakfast we time. We are not. Thank you. Breakfast time. You, let's... You, let's... No, you have, you have promoted the man. You don't want to accept that you promoted okay. Thank somebody you. who is under investigation is now giving a command position. Thank you. Of, of arguably the most prestigious regiment. Thank you. Uh, within the Ghana Army. So, so that is, 13th of June, we're starting the uh, census activity. In fact, the president launched a 30-day countdown last Friday. So we are doing the countdown until 13th of June when we start the uh, enumeration and, and listing of uh, properties. I'd want you to speak to your people in a language they will understand, you know, your local dialect, your L1, so that people will make themselves available for the census and will also allow for the enumerators to mark their properties and to count them for all our good. That's your camera right there, Dennis. So talk to it in a language that the people will understand. Nature, <laughs> Punto do me bar, obe to me home, a quiet or befasoir, or better chinney be as we in us. A fasoir, a was a nipper can kind of say, Eto de beer, say, as I say, a bind, a sea school dying, or now a yap pine, or now O sea, I are a sabia. A home be here so be home pussy, and you be a uko to a nipper hen at all. What do ya he? Now, one do no honour, since ya own chips compound no honour, a so. And I say, when you can say, I can't go on a baby boy. Eh, oko, a kwati a kwaswa, embofra hene oho, omo dudua hene oku school. Oku school da ne oho no, 
Et ça, Anaïsou. Et Na se wonso se aban tiche bibia wetu bia kase bia eh me me she tokuru wem enti me so me dey say say so me so no mo ma me sanka thank you very much uh, then this is a former mc for a from north uh, Ichi, that's your camera you, you also speak to your people in a language they understand yeah, uh, i want everybody to be counted eh ma zamon popo ma ado indina no no vinyo le south dine Peki Pali Pavetongo. Ne Yahua Vemia Nula, Cho Juno Kakawi Tongo, Waklame. A Maka clan, play me a bosso solo to come and I live with the Menya Machio, the Dawakan, Mela Bear election yaw. Nanya de V, baby, ne, no jig, betcher, Javanokli. Nanya Machichi, Nella Home, Nako Fala for the car hundred years, no matins or change of an oakley. Madame Kukuna, Mia Mimito la Glegi, Le Togo do, Chola Jibui, Bumboni Coffe, Bocoffe, Jakiti, Cable Coffe, Sakwe, Germany, Tongo, Atokupo, Agodake, Fanti Coffe, Chanape, To Dugan, Ahon, Kaira, Chita, Abui, Aklaga, Chate, Paybome, Apato, Pachakwe, To Dome. So you coffe, block coffe, mami wata coffe, kanami coffe, to do me. Beve, to put coffe, vegbe, camp, wawasi, a jokwe, a bate, wudo me, jokbati, blango, a fevio fe, chame, jake, a vetile, a nyinsu, a sanga, chienu. Was a camp, le Congo, le Togo de la Messiam and never fair. Mian of him, Toby Till again, Messiam and never fair, and I mean, on Namia, but so so. Ne, ne de two. Alabe, Mio, me Benonami, Hospital Gan, Le Saudine. Mia, but so so I fear. Me be me a stink corridor, mon menu. Mia Mondeke, two two dome, vai to vai Germany, menu. Two a numbo so, du gan menu. Kodjimele miya o siyo. Miya chi. E chi na no mele miya siyo. Le tongo kwa li lain. Miya kwa soso ya fiya. Ta ma de kukuna me siya me be. No jagba no do. No 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 no. Bibi nye me gbele. Bidi o jigbe che. Mi jagba miya ne no no no. Akwe. Ne nye me dro. Ne cho nije. Ne cho mali. Ne cho bokina. Ne cho togo che. E jebe no no miya nko. Ta akwe ne mi kakaka. Akwe gobo. Dan isi ya da se. Ok. So de. De. Conversation now is that Henry Corte, who is a regional minister, is doing a lot of work. He is clearing and decongesting Accra. And I'm sure that other MCs and DCs are watching and hoping to do the same. But nearly two weeks after Henry Corte led a team to undertake a decongestion exercise in some parts of the business uh, the district of Accra, traders and hawkers are back onto the streets for business as usual. This has affected traffic flow on uh, most places, in most places, such as the Swansea Shopping Arcade through Cantaman to CMB to the Rollings Park, uh, visited yesterday by the Ghanaian Times, revealed that the hawkers and traders have flooded the pavements and parts of the streets with their words. Dennis, you have been a former MC before, so maybe this comes to you easily. Why do we spend money to clear people and then they come back? Is it that we don't have anywhere to put them or the people just don't get the signal that we are trying to make our cities Cleaner and better and smarter. Hmm. Uh, Johnny, uh, let me let me say a proper good morning to, mm. to, to, to our viewers and a warm a, a warm one to my people of the KFM North. Mm. I I they need their warmth. The place is cold. I'm telling you, <laughs> I'm telling you, very very cold. I think that this is what a lot of us have, have mm. feared um, since Honorable Henry started this particular exercise. Mm. Uh, clearly, if you if you listen around, it's as if it's one of the few projects that everybody is rallying around him mm. and and supporting him across across the divide, and it's simply because 
we acknowledge as mm -hmm. a people the new sons that we have within our central business, mm -hmm. you know, district area. Uh, there are a couple of activities that he's undertaking mm -hmm. that so far I haven't, I'm yet to hear anybody, you know, speak against. Mm -hmm. The issue of this con this, the congestion, the siren mm -hmm. issue. That's right. And, 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 the and baller the, as well. The baller mm -hmm. issues and then the... The silting uh, of the drains. The silting and unlawful construction of mm -hmm. buildings, mm -hmm. you know, along Water waterways. Waste, yeah. and, and, and it's brought a new wave, wave of energy, you know, into, into the system. Mm -hmm. And um, it's getting a lot of people energized and, and, and moving on. If you see what is happening in Medina, mm -hmm. because I use Medina every morning, mm -hmm. um, the convenience that has been created the there now, mm -hmm. you know, with, with Honorable um, Jennifer, the MC, and, and, and the regional minister, I've seen them, you know, st they've started learning, you know, the area, yeah, planting yeah. some grasses around mm -hmm. there and some ornamental plants, you know, it gives a certain level of serenity, even when you are driving and, mm -hmm. and you are in traffic. And it reduces the traffic drastically in, in, that, in that area. The worry mm -hmm. is that we as a people sometimes do not um, assume any responsibility when it comes to the development of the nation. Mm -hmm. we, we are quick to put blame at the doorstep of leadership without realizing that there are some encumbrances on us, and there are certain things that we must also do to, to support this. I, I agree mm -hmm. that people must live and people, people must survive. Right. But it must not be at the expense of all of us and at the expense of others. Um, if you listen to the treatise, and mm -hmm. I was listening to one of the sound bites from, from one of the women, where they try to justify mm -hmm. with the fact they that have to be there. Mm -hmm. they, they have gone for loans, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. so they need to pay back. And so for them, if selling at the very wrong places, mm -hmm. as well, would let them pay back their loans, then, then so be it. Right. And you and I know that this justification has been there since 1992. Mm -hmm. It is constantly this issue of we need to eat. <laughs> it, it's, we always have to find, constantly find a way of making poverty the reason why we, we, we are not making progress as mm -hmm. a people. I, I think that this time around, we shouldn't allow it to, to survive. Mm -hmm. I think this particular exercise in 2021 must succeed right and so whatever the regional minister needs to do mm. to be able to get these people to to sell at the right places mm. it's a two-way situation the, the markets are congested yeah. as we've found mm. so what options are there for him yeah so i was coming to so mm. it's a it's a, it's a two-way situation the first one has to do even those of us who buy mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. i i i think that if as, as a responsibility as a duty we also decide that listen if you are selling at a wrong place, I won't buy. Mm. This will begin to go to, you know, the right, right. places. The second bit also is that the, the municipal assemblies and then the regional minister in doing all of this mm. must engage these people and probably begin to find alternatives for them. I, I want to be a bit slow on that score because okay. I, have, I, I have been in that situation. You've been before. in that chair before. There are instances mm -hmm. that you put up markets mm -hmm. and I, I i have had it in my municipality before mm -hmm. so you have put up a whole market giving them everything that they need stalls and everything they won't go in there why i don't know i mean we have lorry parks and taxi ranks mm -hmm. you know in 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 our communities that have been built and fully kitted and yet you have drivers you on know the, on the side on the, the on the sides on the side on the side of the of the, of the road and mm -hmm. sometimes their justification is that the the uh, those who patronize them mm -hmm. are not willing to come to where, you they, know, are. where they are. And so they want the easy access to, to, to their patrons mm. so they could sell to them. And I bet you, I won't be surprised, and, and I, I, I am quite inclined to the, to the thought that there's probably an alternative created for them, except that they think that mm. wherever it is that has been given to them, people the, the people will not come. I was recently listening to the onion sellers. Mm -hmm. Who have been, yes, yeah. who have been asked to relocate to Ajin Kutu, mm -hmm. Kutuku or so. Mm -hmm. Ajin Kutuku, yeah. And I, I, I saw the market that has been built mm -hmm. and abandoned. It has even secondary schools, kindergartens, um, lorry parks, everything there. And they are saying, move from here. Take your waste there. You are bulk breakers of onion. So that those who are going to retail will come and pick from mm -hmm. you. And they are saying they will not go. Because in their minds, it is far off. And so our mentality mm -hmm. and our thinking, I think, needs to be reshaped a bit to support leadership in, 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 in this endeavor. But mm -hmm. 
I think that for this particular situation, all of us must really run behind the regional minister to get it so done. that he, he succeeds at this. AJ, what's on your mind? The, the, and it, this is not the first time. I mean, I remember the Natnu Ramate FU, I remember Jerry Blank Singh, I remember Oku Van der Poy, and many of them, uh, Mayor Kwesia Jiman, they will clear people, give them tops one month, they're back. And it's as if we did no work at all. Yes, uh, indeed, it, it, it goes further back into time than what you're citing. Mm -hmm. When the E.T. Mensa. E.T. Mensa. When well, he yeah. used to be, that time it was called Accra City Council. That's right. When he was the mayor of Accra City mm -hmm. Council. Mid 80s, when mm -hmm. we were children in And it spread all yeah. across Medina, yes. Delta, everywhere. Yeah, everywhere that, time, that time he mm -hmm. had control of the whole of mm -hmm. Accra. Mm -hmm. And we were children in Newtown. Uh, Lagos down those days. Uh, you, you see that when it's coming, you, everybody runs, you know. And so that's so it's a long chain of mayors who have tried to decongest, mm. and not the city like people want to say. But the the pavement, mm -hmm. it's the decongestion is not about the city, but it's about the pavement. How how petty traders clog the pavements with mm. their everyday wares and they are tabletop uh, uh, businesses. Mm -hmm. Now, the, it, it appears that it's, it's an interim measure. Mm -hmm. But what is the mid-term mid or long-term plan? Tell me. We need to plan our cities in such a way that we can establish growth pool projects. Like my brother said, markets are built. You know, the the CBD every 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 serious city has a CBD. Right. Some are even moving away from calling it central business district to downtown. Okay. Because they have found a way to decongest. Mm. How do they do it? Because persons from South Dine, mm. in Chanakwe, in Germany, in Tou, who travel all the way to uh, Makola, Makola to buy certain things that they can actually get to buy in Ashama, for instance, mm. Mm. or in Tema. Why would they do that? Just because small price differentials. But they will spend that money on, on fuel. Yes, when you do the computation, you see that if they, if they are stopped at Tema or Ashama to even purchase, they would have, comparatively, they would have, mm. they would have, they would have fared better economically. Mm. But they would prefer to come to the center of Accra. It's a mentality. Yes. But we are not, it, 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 and that is actually the problem. That's why every morning, you see, every traffic headed towards central of Accra, a third of that are public servants. But two thirds of the traffic flow into Accra is about people who are coming to buy one thing mm, or the mm, other. Mm. Okay? Or sell one thing or the other. Mm. But when the markets are located in the suburbs, look at, look at where Medina Market is. Mm -hmm. Look at the number of persons who throng there every weekend. And yet look at the traffic flow from Medina still into CBD uh, of Accra. People still come down. Exactly. Down. Now we are thinking of constructing a dual carriage, two lane, from around the Adenta Junction all the way to Dodoa. Mm -hmm. Are we thinking of locating a major market on that stretch? I'm sure the sensors that, will help. That, yes, that because is the way the demographics we should, will come That is the play. way once, once we are we are thinking of rehabilitating the railway line from Accra to Kumasi. Mm. But we haven't thought of locating a major market along the line. Even the railway has been encroached. I, I agree. <laughs> I agree. But these are, these are the thinking that yeah. should be going to the right. projects. Mm. So we can reduce the traffic. We can reduce the congestion. Mm. Everybody thinks that you have to get to the center of Accra, mm. set up your tabletop business on the pavement before you can... You can make a living. I've seen a very beautiful rail line from uh, Tema to Mpakadan. Yeah. Very beautiful one. Yes. It's coming up strongly. Yes. But all the things you are talking about, yes. you we can't are, find them on yes. the site. And, and I see rather drinking spots and chobas <laughs> hanging up on, on the site. So we need to locate... <laughs> that is private yeah, we need to locate economic points of mm. operation along these major lines. So that my people, they don't have to hustle. Look, when you, when you leave home mm. in the village, let's say... Even if you leave at 3.30 a.m., mm -hmm. and these days, the, the traders are afraid because of upsurge in, in uh, 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 highway, 
persons who mm. will lay you on the highway. They are that robbers or you don't know. So they are minded to leave like 5 a.m. Of, or 4.30. 4 yeah. You get to Afiena by 6 o'clock. Mm -hmm. You get out of Afiena onto the motorway by 9 a.m. Mm. Three hours just in traffic, a distance of about 12 kilometers between Afiena and the, uh, 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 the new motorway mm. interchange. Three hours. So, so it's a problem that, yes, we are the in, in the interim, mm. we are clearing, but he shouldn't stop. Okay. He has to do, in fact, it's, if, if he can sustain it every month, mm. he will conduct operations. But, but it costs money. Oh. It costs the a lot of I money. I had a chat with him. I agree. And Mayor Van der Poy and I think uh, yes. Mayor Ajay Blancy. Yeah, Ajay the, the figures they mentioned. Yes, Mr. Amate, um, uh, Mayor Amate is still alive. Yeah, Amate few years. Yeah, Amate the Amate figures they mentioned. Yes. Not because, you see, because you see, you fall on the security services. Mm to give you men who will, be, who will be moved for that day or two, they will be moved from their usual, usual mm. places of operation. Mm -hmm. You have to feed them. <sighs> you understand? The men who follow you to go and do this clearing without mm. feeding them. You have to motivate them. Mm. It costs a lot of money. It takes him away from his desk work. Mm. Those are some of the opportunity calls that we we'll have to okay. face in this matter. Okay. So we need to it decentralize do it, properly. He shouldn't mm. do it once and just go away. Mm. It, should be, it should be periodic. Every month he should operate. Every month Will he, he have operate. the free hand to do? He should. I, I think I agree with uh, my, uh, Dennis that mm. for, in a, for, for once in a long time, everybody appears to appreciate what he's doing. So once there's that appreciation, I don't think it's, it's boss who would have a problem. The okay. presidency will have a problem with him. Okay. As, so far as he's doing so within some reasonable means of the law. Mm. Mm. You don't, I, I hear that he's demolishing a lot of property. Yeah. But I hope that they are sharks and, uh, and unauthorized structures, mm. not, not buildings as mm. immovable property that are. In fact, when, when we checked the other time, yeah. you had, so Dennis has a plot of land. Mm. And in front of that plot of land, there's supposed to be a pavement. Yeah. Then Dennis extends his property onto the pavement. And now you have the pedestrians walking on the street. We call so, them the eaves. So <laughs> those, those are the ones that they are clearing. And yeah. I know that the Gbisi Palace also did some work with the AMA yeah. to clear most we of them. We call that people extend the eaves. You know, you know, let, me, let, me, let me drop this quick. So you know how sometimes people use poverty mm -hmm. as a justification to... To con to conduct Because I remember, I remember. You know, there's there's a, there's, there's, you're 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 poor, you're I'm poor. Let me. I'm breaking the law. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. exactly. <laughs> I, we have some state lands mm. in the Kiafim mm. North, and so um, it got to a point where you have maybe Ghana Grains Board okay. using it for their mm. demonstration farm, and then we say we wanted to industrialize. Mm. So you try to get industries to come mm. there. They don't. And then you get there, yeah. and you have people who are farming yeah. without yeah. authorization. Yeah. Without notice, and they nobody want, knows them. No compensation. And no. then when you go and tell them that, oh, that's for this place. Yeah, we are trying to make sure that we bring some businesses so that they will employ our people. And then, you say, so, but who gave here to you? you say, oh, but why? It is state lands. Me, I'm hungry, so I have to. <laughs> no, no, so if you are hungry, it justifies you entering my kitchen yeah. and picking anything no, no, at all. No, but you know, but you know, that is why I, I, I'm saying that mm. it shouldn't pawns. He shouldn't pounce once and, and leave. Okay. He should pounce. In fact, he should do it every month. Every mm. fourth Saturday, he should pounce. Mm. When, they get, when they get to know, they won't come back. You see, in law, if you allow somebody, a squatter, to take root on your property, he acquires what we call <laughs> prescriptive rights. I read, I read that. I read that. You you know, so you have to use legal means yeah. to kick the person out. You, can you can't just get up and... You know, so... These are things that uh, I, I pray that I pray that Henry Quarty is strengthened this morning. Uh, but that is not comparable to people who are who are peddling mm. their words on the on the yeah, 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 Because you see, they move they move away at mm. night. Mm. Mm. They they go to their various homes at night and mm. and descend at dawn okay. to come and settle. By the time you come, they are settled. Okay. Yes. So so that's <laughs> what I'm saying. If if they know that this man will pounce before they by three a.m. he's there. They have, they they are moved. They anyway. don't come. They hover around and go back. Eventually they will. They yeah, will but I, th I think creating the alternatives for them is also quite cool. I agree. It is. But yeah, it, it has is. it has been created. Yeah, I think it's in I think three or four vantage areas. Yeah. You, you I, 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 I know it's, that the pedestrian market, for example, that caught fire recently. 
Oh, had, that, that player has been like three times. Yes, but it had spaces in there. Yeah. Yeah. And the people were sitting on the pavement. There are several, markets, you are explaining. There are several markets in Accra here. That has the stores and the, and the, and the spaces locked down. Mm. And they are on the streets. Okay, let's take a quick break. We'll return shortly to come continue <laughs> the conversation. I'm sure you're uh, enjoying and we hope to read your comments shortly. Stay with us. We'll be right back.